rattles out a three. Kevin Durant to Kyrie Irving all along. He brings one up. Drew, I don't know why I'm asking you this, because you probably never really had the assignment as Kevin Durant gets the end one. <laughs> Durant, the fadeaway jump shot is pure. Like you've always said, Drew, where can you get the best offensive efficiency? Seth Curry's three is off the mark. Offensive rebound by Irving. Here's Durant in the paint, scores. Double figures with 10 points. Durant steps into another three. He's hitting back to back threes as Wes Unsell Jr. calls time. Kevin Durant with 13. As he saw what happened, it's like bees to honey. Guys are going to collapse, and that opened up Kismet in that corner. Excellent feed there by Clark. Here's Durant. Good one off the Porzingis screen. Steal there by Claxton. He's to Edmund Sumner. He gets an easy lay-in. Kevin Durant swings it out to Harris. Here's Simmons on a crossover. Wizards wanted to travel. Leads to Kevin Durant touching nothing but nylon. It don't matter if he's on the road, at home. They don't know how to guard Porzingis with him making that last jump shot. So Avdia once again trying to guard Durant. Durant's fadeaway is good. Stripped there by Joe Harris. Can Joe be rewarded for his defense? Yes, he can. We've seen this season, Will Barton doing that exact same move to just almost losing their shoes. Joe Harris' jumper rattles in. Porzingis run to the rim. Great things can happen. Kevin Durant. Gets the bucket, he'll go to the line for the three-point play. If you wanted to see more rebounding, you got that one from Daniel there. Gaffer clearly had a matchup that he would have favored. Wizards couldn't get him the ball. Having these capabilities throughout his career, especially in Denver. Kevin Durant. Under five here at Capital One Arena. Dan Thomas. That's his shot. Over Avia. That's what he does best. He gets buckets when he needs it. Good. Four seconds on the shot clock. Kevin Durant. 